Course Copy is back. We fixed it and we, I'm going to show you how to use it and then how to watch out for signs that it might break again. So this is the course from the winter semester that I want to copy over into the spring. So I'm going to go to the donor course and in packages and utilities go to course copy and then leave the first thing at default, the select copy type, and then go down to destination course ID and browse for the course that I'm going to copy it into the recipient. In this case, it's the spring course and submit and then go select all. The reason we select all is because there's some things that are linked, like for instance, the assignments are linked in quizzes to the Grade Center, so I don't want to break those links. But things that are, are safe to unclick are announcements. And in Discussion Board, um, in some people's cases, the instructor sets the starter posts and they want to keep those, and that's the default. In my case, I did not make the starter posts, my students did, so I want to get rid of that and only copy the structure of my Discussion Boards. Um, now, if you hit submit, make sure, watch that you only click it once. If you hit it twice, then it's going to cause a problem. Um, also, if I click it and it doesn't seem to go away, it just stays there, just wait. Don't think that you didn't click it and click it again. Um, if it takes a long time, that's when there's a problem and you need to contact me. Uh, email me at areil at mtroyal.ca or phone me at 403-440-7002. Now it's probably done. If I can go to the my BB courses and go into the new site, it'll say complete here when it's done. And in my case, it is done and everything's been copied over.